Pam, 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 pam. Trump, tonight I'm going to need your bonds like no one has ever needed them in their life. All right, guys, welcome to the Mortal Kombat Showdown. In the left corner, we've got Joe the Scorpion Biden, and in the right corner, Donald Sub-Zero Trump. Are you ready to rumble? You bet, Barack. Get over here, Donnie. I'm the best at Mortal Kombat, folks. Nobody does Mortal Kombat better than me. You can't escape, Donnie. Stop lying there like a street dog. I will rip you to shreds. You're going to taste my bolt tonight. Now, Donnie. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's a good shot. I'm just warming up. Come here, baby. Joe, today you're going to kiss my 21st finger, and you're going to love it. Feel the burn, Donnie. I almost made my super move, Joe. You're in luck now. So first up in the first round is Sleepy Joe. Look at him. He's a monster, not a human being. Now, guys, give me a little time to get the controls, and I'll show you what love means. Why, I sir, I'm like, he said, oh, what, he said, what kind of love are you talking about, Donnie? <laughs> Look, that's my love, Sleepy Joe. Donnie's using a band combo. Guys, what's he doing? Come here, my sweet baby. Oh, man, that's a death blow, guys. Oh, man, you guys, look what he's doing to him. How's that for love, Donnie? Please shut your mouth. You're making it hard for me to concentrate. This is how we'll settle debates from now on, Donnie. Remember, it's just a game, gentlemen. No need for alternative facts here. For the American people, Scorpion's victory. All right, Biden, prepare to feel the icy wrath of Sub-Zero. All right, gentlemen, let's see some Mortal Kombat action. Biden, remember to use Scorpion's spear attack by pressing down. Back, punch. Oh, shit, it's fatalities. Will Joe be able to do it? <laughs> you are the biggest nub in the history of mankind, Joe. So let's summarize the first fight for Joe Biden. I'll make sure to roast you with it, Trump. Dream on, Sleepy Joe. Sub-Zero will freeze that fiery spirit of yours. Whoa, guys, simmer down. No need to get personal. Let's keep the game fierce but friendly. Yeah, right. I'll show you friendly. Get over here, Trump. You think you can take me down, Biden? Freeze. Whoa, Trump. Keep it civil. Remember, the key to victory is strategy, not just button smashing. Strategy? That's not your strong suit, Trump. I'll show you, Biden. Ice clone attack. All right, the fight is getting intense, folks. Biden, watch out for Sub-Zero's ice clone move. Duck and counter with a combo. Take that, Trump! Feel the sting of Scorpion's fire! It's not over yet. Frost hammer. Whew! This battle is heating up, or should I say freezing up? Biden, watch your health bar. I won't back down, Obama! Scorpion's teleport punch! Curse you, Sub-Zero. Try me a river, Scorpion. Oh, Trump is showing skill. Well played, Trump, but I'll get you next time. Sure, Biden, keep dreaming. What a match, gentlemen. Let's have a rematch soon and see who reigns supreme in Mortal Kombat XL. I'll make sure to annihilate Trump's Sub-Zero. Oh, you wish. Scorpion won't stand a chance against my ice powers. Take that, Biden. Sub-Zero's freezing powers are unstoppable. Ha! Scorpion's spear attack will catch you off guard, Trump. I must say, it's quite amusing to watch these two try to outwit each other. I'm not giving up. Prepare to lose, Biden. Oh, it's on. Scorpion will show no mercy. Victory! I told you, Trump, Scorpion is superior. Well played, Biden, but the battle isn't over yet. I demand a rematch. Aha! Looks like the Mortal Kombat rivalry continues. You guys never fail to entertain me. Oh, really, Donald? I find that hard to believe. I remember giving you a run for your money the last time we played together. Come on, guys. We all know I have the skills to beat both of you. I've mastered all the fatalities and brutalities. Joe, you may be good, but I doubt you're anywhere near as talented as me. I mean, have you seen my combos? They're tremendous, just like my presidency. Donald. Your combos may be flashy, but they don't stand a chance against my strategy and finesse. Remember when I used Raiden's teleport to catch you off guard? Classic move. Sub-Zero wins. All right, all right. Let's settle this once and for all. 
we should have a Mortal Kombat tournament to determine who's the strongest. Winner gets bragging rights. I'm in, Joe, but be prepared to witness the greatest victory in gaming history. They'll dedicate a whole chapter in the Mortal Kombat manual to my skills. Don't get too ahead of yourself, Donald. I might have to choose Sub-Zero and freeze your overinflated ego. This is going to be epic. I'll pick Scorpion and make sure both of you feel the burn. Scorpion, I always knew you had a fiery side, Joe. Prepare to face my unbeatable Liu Kang moves. Gentlemen, no matter who wins, let's remember that it's just a game. But I have a feeling I'll be the one ending up with the victory. We'll see about that, Barack. Prepare yourself for a beatdown you'll never forget. Strap in, boys. You're about to witness my incredible gaming skills. It's going to be tremendous, just like everything I do. All right, gentlemen, let's settle this once and for all. We're here to discuss the strongest character in Mortal Kombat XL. Now, I firmly believe that Scorpion is the most powerful fighter. Joe, 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 you couldn't be more wrong. Scorpion may have some flashy moves, but when it comes to raw strength and dominance, Sub-Zero takes the cake. He freezes his opponents to the core. Guys, guys, calm down. Both of you are overlooking the obvious choice. The strongest character in the game is none other than myself, President Barack Obama. Haven't you seen my moves? Oh, come on, Barack. You may have some slick moves in real life, but in Mortal Kombat XL, Scorpion's spear and his fiery powers make him unbeatable. The guy is literally a hellish ninja. Joe, you're delusional. Scorpion may have his fancy spear, but Sub-Zero's ice-cold abilities are unmatched. He freezes his foes, shatters them into pieces, and still manages to look cool doing it. Plus, he's got that icy stare that could freeze anyone in their tracks. All right, fellas, let's not get too heated here. Joe, I appreciate your loyalty to Scorpion, but let me remind you both that the true strength lies in leadership. And who can deny that I led this country with strength and conviction? Well, Barack, you sure did have your moments, but in the realm of Mortal Kombat XL, it's all about pure physical power. Scorpion's teleportation and his iconic get over here or move are unbeatable. He's got the whole package. Sorry, Joe, but you're living in a fantasy world. Sub-Zero's freezing abilities and brutal finishing moves are just on a different level. No one can deny his dominance in the game. This is the end of you. Round two. Fight. All right, I see we're not going to agree on this one. But let's remember, gentlemen, this is just a game. We're all winners in our own right. You're right, Brock. Let's just leave it at that. We may not agree on Mortal Kombat XL, but the important thing is that we can still have a good laugh and enjoy our friendly banter. Exactly, Joe. At the end of the day, it's all about having fun and enjoying each other's company. And hey, maybe we can all team up and take on the Mortal Kombat tournament together. Now there's a thought, gentlemen. A united front against the forces of evil. Who knows, maybe we'll conquer Mortal Kombat XL as the most unorthodox team ever assembled. That was an awesome fight, guys. Biden pulls out a victory. Scorpion. Ha ha ha, Trump. Nice move with Raiden. Stop this now, Raiden. I can no sooner stop the sun's rising. Thanks, Obama, but you won't be laughing for long. Watch out, here comes an epic Kung Lao combo. You think you can beat me, Trump? Think again. Brace yourself for some flawless victories. Oh, I can't contain my laughter. You guys are hilarious. But let's see who has the skills to actually win this match. Don't underestimate my lightning abilities, Biden. I'll electrocute you right out of this game. 
Lightning? That's nothing compared to Kung Lao's brutal strikes. Get ready to be taken down, Trump. This game should definitely be renamed Political Combat. You two are putting on quite a show. I'll show you who the true champion is, Obama. Raiden's power will crush all opposition. Huh. Don't get too confident, Trump. Kung Lao's agility will outmaneuver your every move. All right, the fight is on. Let's settle this Mortal Kombat style. Winner gets bragging rights in the Oval Office. Hey there, Trump. I heard you've been talking a big game about being the best Mortal Kombat XL player. Well, Joe, let me tell you, I've got the best moves. Everybody says so. I'm tremendous at this game. Come on, Donald. Don't go all fake news on me. You might have big hands, but can you handle Sub-Zero's ice powers? Joe, I can handle anything. I've got the best combos. People love my combos. Really? I'd like to see you handle Scorpion's get over here move. It's a game changer. Joe, my Make Mortal Kombat Great Again campaign is in full swing. I'll build a wall around your character. Donald, we need unity in this game. We'll have a tournament, and the winner gets the nuclear launch codes. Deal, Joe, but just remember, I'm going to win bigly. And when I do, I'll make sure the video game ratings are through the roof. It's a deal, Donald. May the best president win in Mortal Kombat and in life. Come here, I'll show you grown-up games. Watch out for Trump's special move. It's called Twitter Fury. It's not very effective, but it sure is annoying. I didn't know executive orders were a special combo move in Mortal Kombat. Impressive. Use your wisdom strike against Trump. It's super effective when, I, when it hits. I bet your favorite character is Sub-Zero, you know, because of all that ice on your tweets. Your finishing move should be the Grandpa Wisdom Slam. Just make sure you remember where you left it. Bum -ba -da -bum -bum -bum. Aye, aye, aye. This is a Barry rematch. Now I'm going to punish you with my own hands. I remember how you bullied me yesterday, Joe. I'm not going to let you do that tonight. I'm the best fighter this year, and my Ermac is going to show you how to make history tonight. Let me smear you right now. Guys, stay calm. Don't let your emotions get the best of you. Burn the coward. I won't give you a chance to beat me. All right, Biden, get ready to experience the power of my gaming skills. I am the one and only Ermac, the master of telekinesis. Oh, please, Trump, you can't handle the fast-paced attacks of the mighty Liu Kang. Prepare to be defeated. All right, gentlemen, let's make this fair. Remember, it's all about timing and strategy. Here's a little hint. Press the punch button in combination with the joystick to unleash a brutal combo. Combo, Schmambo. I don't need any hints, Obama. My button-smashing technique will crush Biden like a weak NPC. Get up. Don't underestimate me, Trump. I've been practicing my flying kicks and bicycle kicks. Get ready to taste defeat. Smell my toes. Ha! Taste defeat? That's a good one, Sleepy Joe. I'll have you know I've got the best Mortal Kombat skills in the world. My ratings are through the roof. Good, Joe. Donnie, you're falling behind. All right, gentlemen, let's settle this in Mortal Kombat XL. Remember, blocking is essential. Use the corresponding button to protect yourself from your opponent's attacks. All right, Biden, get ready to feel the wrath of my Ermac. Bring it on, Donnie boy. You're about to learn why they call me the Master of Fire. Meet my Liu Kang. Thanks for the tip, Obama. I won't let Trump's relentless assaults break me. Come on, Liu Kang, show him what you're made of. You're all talk, Biden. Prepare for my telekinetic fury. Your puny fireballs won't stand a chance against my mighty force. Just like my wall, you're gonna crumble. We'll see about that, Trump. Liu Kang's speed and agility will outsmart your Ermac any day. Get ready for some intense flame fists.
Remember, gentlemen, the special moves can turn the tide of the battle. Combine certain buttons to execute devastating attacks. I don't need special moves, Obama. My raw power alone will crush Biden's hopes of victory. You can't handle this, Sleepy Joe. This is what real power looks like. Power? Ha, huh. you talk a big game, but all you're good at is bankrupting businesses and paying off porn stars. We'll see, Trump. Get ready for some bone-crushing bicycle kicks. I'll make Ermac wish he never teleported into this battle. All right, gentlemen, let the Mortal Kombat XL match commence. May the best gamer president win. So, guys, I've been thinking, if we could be characters from Mortal Kombat XL, who would we be? I mean, imagine the possibilities. Hmm, that's a tough one, Donald. I'd probably go with Sub-Zero. He's cool, calm, and collected, just like me. Plus, I could freeze my opponents in their tracks with my policies. Well, Joe, I respect your choice, but I think I'd go with Raiden. He's all about justice and protecting the innocent. Just like me, always fighting for what's right. Interesting choices, guys, but I have to go with Scorpion. He's fiery, intense, and always gets his revenge. Plus, that get over here to move? Perfect for my negotiating skills. <laughs> Donald, I can totally picture you saying get over here while building a wall or something. Unity strike! Hey, Joe, at least I'd get things done. And besides, Scorpion's got style. Remember, I am the most stylish president ever. Shut your trap, Biden. Why don't you focus on remembering your own name instead of trying to beat me? My memory might not be perfect, but at least I don't use fake tan to look like a Cheeto. All right, all right. Let's not forget the real reason we're here. We're leaders of our countries, not Mortal Kombat characters. But it's fun to imagine, isn't it? Absolutely, Barack. It's good to have some fun and let loose once in a while. Just glad we're not actually fighting each other. Can you imagine the chaos? Oh, Joe, the world doesn't need us causing more chaos. Let's leave the fighting to the professionals, shall we? Fair enough, Barack. But I bet if we were Mortal Kombat characters, we'd be the most powerful trio ever seen. Nobody could top us. Well, in the real world or the realm of Mortal Kombat, we certainly know how to make an impact. That's for sure. Now, let's get back to reality and focus on doing our best for the people. Maybe we should have a Mortal Kombat tournament as a team-building exercise, though. Now that's an idea, Barack. I'll start practicing my get over here move just in case. Who knows what the future holds? Oh, it's never a dull moment with you, Donald. But hey, let's focus on unity and peace, okay? Agreed, guys. Let's keep striving to make a difference in this world, even without superpowers. We've got work to do. All right, folks, listen up. We're here to settle the greatest debate of our time. Who knows Mortal Kombat XL combos better, me or Sleepy Joe? Oh, please, Donald. You really think you stand a chance against my flawless Liu Kang skills? Don't make me laugh. Come on, man. I've got the combos that will send you back to The Apprentice. You're no match for my Sub-Zero moves. Sub-Zero? Joe, you freeze up more than you blink, believe me. My Scorpion will incinerate you faster than a nasty tweet. Don't get too cocky, Donald. My Raiden's lightning attacks will send shockwaves through your ego and your combo knowledge simultaneously. You You think you're the only one with cool powers? My Johnny Cage will deliver a political punch that no wall can protect you from.
Please, Joe, I'll demolish you with my Goro's mighty punches, even with my tiny hands, unlike those gloves of yours. Goro? The only thing that's going to be demolished here is your fragile ego, Donald. And hey, Joe, at least I can still remember my combos. I can't say the same about you. That's it, you senile old man. I'm going to finish you off with my signature move, the You're Fired Uppercut. Good luck landing that move, Donnie. Just like your failed presidency, you're all talk and no action. Look who's talking, mister. I forgot which button blocks. Your katana won't even touch my Kung Lao stylish hat tricks. You know what, guys? Let's settle this in a real-life Mortal Kombat battle. Winner takes all. Agreed. But if I win, you have to admit that my Affordable Care Act was the best thing since flawless victories. Keep dreaming, Biden. While you're busy trying to beat me, I'll be making America great again. Great again? More like making America hate again? Your time in the White House was a disaster. I hope you learned your lesson, Biden. The champ remains undefeated. Well, 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 look who decided to show up. Sleepy Joe and the failed former president. What a dynamic duo. Oh, please, Donald. You're still sore about losing the election, huh? Just can't handle the fact that people are tired of your constant lies and incompetence. Lies? Incompetence? Joe, you've been in politics for over 40 years, and what have you accomplished? <clears throat> Nothing. Just a career politician who loves to sniff women's hair. Now, now, gentlemen, let's keep it civil. Don't forget, Donald, that you inherited a booming economy from me and managed to run it into the ground. Oh, please, Barack, your so-called economic recovery was a joke, just a bunch of fancy numbers to make it seem like you knew what you were doing. But we all know the truth. Donald, you can't even properly handle a global pandemic. Your lack of leadership has cost thousands of American lives. It's time for someone who actually knows what they're doing to take charge. Joe, you've been in politics for so long, I'm surprised you even remember what it's like to work. All you do is talk, talk, talk. But when it comes to action, you're nowhere to be found. Donald, you can try to spin it however you want, but the American people can see through your lies. Your divisive rhetoric and bigotry have no place in this country. Bigotry? Please, Barack, you're the one who didn't do anything to secure our borders, and now you expect us to believe you care about the American people? Donald, your obsession with blaming others is pathetic. The fact is you were a disaster as president. It's time for real leadership to restore integrity to the White House. Real leadership? Joe, you couldn't lead a parade if your life depended on it. The American people saw through your empty promises, and that's why they chose me. Ernak, your time is over. Not while a car lives. Round one, fight! <laughs> Hey, Sleepy Joe, you think you can take me on? I'll grab you by the... Well, you know what? Ermac is going to finish you off. Come on, man. You're all talk. No action. You couldn't even handle a game of dodgeball. But guess what? Liu Kang is going to deliver a knockout kick to your ego. You're a total loser, Joe. I built the greatest economy ever, and you want to destroy it. Ermac is going to build a wall around you and make you pay for it. Oh, really, Mr. Businessman? You bankrupted casinos. Liu Kong is going to sweep the floor with you and expose your failed deals. Fake news, Joe. You've been in politics for 47 years, and what have you done? Nothing. Ermac is going to show you what real power looks like. Don't you dare lecture me, you clown. I'll beat you like I beat Corn Pop. Liu Kong will send you back to your reality TV show, where you belong. You're going to regret ever challenging me, Joe. Ermac is going to make America great again by crushing you. We already made America great, Donald. Now we're going to make it even greater by getting rid of your incompetence. Liu Kang is going to deliver the final blow to your presidency.
All right, enough of this bickering. We all have our differences, but let's remember that we're here to serve the American people. It's time to put aside personal attacks and work together for the greater good. Fine, Barack. But mark my words, the American people will see through your failed policies and elect me for a second term. Just you wait and see. bum ba da pum 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 All right, Obama, you're going down. I'm taking Alien, the best fighter in the galaxy. We'll see about that, Trump. I've got Predator, a worthy opponent for your alien. Guys, your favorite wives are watching your game. Don't embarrass yourselves. Boys, play nice. Remember, it's just a game. I'm gonna rip out your chocolate eye. She's right. Let's keep it friendly, gentlemen. You've got this, Donald. Finish him. Come on, Barack. Show him what you've got. How do you like that, Obama? Impressive, but I'm not done yet. I win. It's a tremendous victory. Well played, Trump. You got me this time. Bravo, Donald. Great job, Barack. Good game, Obama. Indeed, Trump. Good game. What a weak game, guys. Show a real battle between two of the best players this year. Stop playing like losers and have a Donald B day. Come on, Barack. Show us what you can do. Stop patting him on the head. Come on, Donnie. Come on, Donnie. Give me a jujitsu master class, Donnie. Oh my God, Obama, you're waving your arms around like a girl in a club. You've got this, Donald. Finish him. Round two, fight. Come on, Barack, show him what you've got. That was a fantastic combo, Donald. You're doing great, Barack. Keep it up. Oh no, Donald's in trouble. Barack, watch out for that special move. This is getting intense, folks. We can do this, Predator. Hang in there, Donald. You can turn this around. You've got this, Barack. Finish strong. It's a tie. What a close match. Well, I guess that settles it, Obama. We're evenly matched. Indeed, Trump. A tie it is. Great game, gentlemen. You both did amazing. My brilliant and universal intuition tells me that Barack doesn't stand a chance against this insane opponent named Donald. Oh my God, guys, what is he doing? Look at this level of play. It's like a god came down from heaven to teach us Earthlings how to play this game. Oh, sweetheart, looks like you're having a bad time. Now I suggest you, my friend, let's fight in this game like real women. Oh, you defy me. Fear me, for you will know the sorrow of defeat. You are unfit to live. Go, Melania, show her the art of winning. Come on, Michelle, make those moves count. Ladies and gentlemen, gather round as we witness the epic showdown between Melania Trump and Michelle Obama. The stakes are high, the energy is palpable, and my friends, this Mortal Kombat battle is about to go down in history. That's it, Melania. Strike with precision. Michelle, unleash those powerful combos. Michelle, you might want to stick to diplomacy. These combat skills might not be your strong suit. Now, folks, let me take a moment to appreciate the skill on display here. Melania's katana, with those swift and calculated moves, is dancing around the screen. Meanwhile, Michelle's Melina is countering with ferocious agility, creating a visual spectacle that rivals the grandeur of the Lincoln Memorial. Round two, fight. That's my wife. Tremendous move, Melania. Michelle, you've got this. Don't back down. You bet, Melania. Let's see if your fashion sense can match your combat skills. As we witness this clash of titans, let me draw a parallel to the challenges our nation faces. Just as these two fierce competitors navigate the virtual arena, we, as a nation, must navigate the complex arena of global affairs and domestic policies. It requires strategic thinking, resilience, and the occasional flawless combo. Melania, finish strong. Give it your all. Michelle, show her the power of perseverance. Final round, fight. In the spirit of unity and friendly competition, let us remember that even in the face of differing perspectives, we can come together, appreciate each other's strengths, and build a stronger, more resilient nation. Melania, 
Remember, I've got the Let's Move initiative. I can dance circles around. Melania. You. Yes, that's a win for Team Trump. And there you have it, folks. A riveting display of skill, sportsmanship, and the enduring spirit of competition. Now let us all join in applause for these remarkable women and the lessons they've imparted to us on this virtual battlefield. Bravo. Who said anything about me being defeated by a little girl? I demand a rematch. No, no, girl. You'll only get a rematch after our rematch. Yeah, Donnie. Now I'm going to show you the real power of Predator Barack. Well, Barack, it looks like we're back for a rematch. You bet, Trump. I've been practicing my moves. Come on, Donald. You can do it. Go, Barack. Show him who's boss. Folks, we've got another thrilling rematch on our hands. Trump and Obama are locked in digital combat, determined to settle the score. I mean, you've got to admire their tenacity, even in the world of virtual brawling. That's it, Donald. Show him what you're made of. Brock, give it your all. Ah, uh, there's something so captivating about this showdown. It's like watching a Shakespearean drama, but with more special effects and fewer soliloquies. I've got this, Obama. We'll see about that, Trump. Look at them go. It's almost like they're competing for... I don't know, bragging rights or something. You know, I have to hand it to these two. They may have left the Oval Office, but they're still going head to head in a digital bloodbath. It's almost poetic, isn't it? Come on, Donald, just a little more. Barack, you've got to hang in there. And it's heating up, folks. Who will emerge victorious in this epic clash of titans? My money's on the one with the best combo finish. Another tie, Obama. It seems we're evenly matched once again. Jump on your face right now, Donnie. Great job, Donald. You both did amazing. Well, there you have it, folks. Another thrilling showdown between these two former leaders. I have to say, I can't help but be entertained by their competitive spirit. Let's hear it for Trump and Obama. It's a beautiful battle, guys. But now it's time for a rematch with you, my sweet friend. Now I'm going to show you how hard. Go, Melania. Show them your strength. You've got this, Michelle. Make those moves count. You are a perversion. I am Empress of Outworld. Round one. Come on, Melania, you've got this. Show them what you're made of. Michelle, remember your training. Execute those combos. Ladies, 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 ladies and gentlemen, here we have the much-anticipated rematch between Melania Trump and Michelle Obama, two powerful women in their own right, now facing off in Mortal Kombat. It's incredible how life can take unexpected turns, isn't it? Michelle, time your combos perfectly. Melania, stay focused. Use your special moves. Round two, fight! 
Watching this clash of titans, I can't help but think of the parallels to leadership in their roles. They each had to adapt, strategize, and overcome challenges. Now they're taking those skills to the virtual battlefield. Life is full of surprises, folks. Ah, oh, the intensity of this duel. It's almost Shakespearean, isn't it? The swords, well, in this case, says and fans, they are crossed. It's a tale of revenge, redemption, or maybe just a good old rematch. Hang in there, Melania. You've got this. Keep it up, Michelle. Finish strong. It's all coming down to this, folks. The climax, the crescendo, the grand finale. Who will emerge victorious and claim the title of Mortal Kombat champion? Victory is mine. Well done, Melania. You earned it. And there you have it, folks, a sensational match, a testament to the indomitable spirit of competition, and a reminder that life can take unexpected twists and turns. Bravo to both Melania and Michelle for a thrilling showdown.